Hello everyone, my name is Roman and today we're going to do a Tlia jungle guide in Flex. We're going to be against Kha'Zix and we're going to talk about runes, builds and everything that you need to know in order for you to play this champion properly in jungle. And thank you very much for the all the input that you've done for the last video. I see everyone else has the same concerns as me and really I didn't see a single person that says that Tlia is in an okay place which is kind of eh, but um, we're, it's fine, I guess we're all agreeing on the same thing, that we need some changes, and we're going to see if Riot is going to do something about it or not. But till then, we're going to play Talia in the jungle, and we're going to talk about this stuff, and let's see. I'm playing with Dark Harvest, because I have an Altilius bot with engages, and Lucian top that fights a lot, probably the Wukong. And on mid, probably there will be ganks on Akali, so we have to counter gank that. I'm playing with Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, Ravenous Hunter, Presence of Mind, Cup the Grace, and these rune stats. Obviously, you can go secondary, you can go for uh, uh, Nimbus Cloak and Celerity or Water Walking, a combination of those. And there is also an option for this Presence of Mind, Cup the Grace, which is kind of strong because you'll have infinite mana, but depends on your playstyle generally. Okay, so we're going now to right, we're going to cast E, going to get healed up, but actually, actually I'm going to red secondary, not right, because if Kha'Zix wants to invade, uh, we're going to be better this way, I suppose, because I'm more healthy, right, and if I smite it, I'll be full HP, so I'll be able to combat Kha'Zix invade, right, so we stay here around a bit, we do a full Q in this way, kite, 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 then we're going towards the bot side, Cast an E, cast an Q, and we're gonna smite it right here so that so that we don't risk it. Now I'm gonna wait some seconds for the E. I don't see the Twisted Fate, so be careful. We wanna wait some seconds because we want to have the E on cooldown for this because it heals a lot, right? We get a lot, a lot of heal from this, and I'm just gonna do a full Q here. I'm gonna position myself towards this zone to cast a Q. Alright, get these. Oops, missed a small queue there. Okay, and I'm going towards Golems, but towards this side, because in case if Kha'Zix decides to check out, he's probably not going more than this much. Okay, as we can see, he's here. And now we just throw a knee, throw a smite. Also, he's level 3 because of the caps he took. And probably he stole also some minion or something, but it's fine. We can't get this, he's probably going to get the Scuttle, but if we move fast towards the bot side, we can actually get Scuttle there too. So that's why I don't stay fully on these minions, so I don't take all of them because I really want to reach, I really want to reach the Scuttle on the bot side. It's some 15 gold and some experience, not that much, but I believe we have time to get the Scuttle here. And then we can maybe even think of a bot gang. Also, the CS is highly in favorable towards the Akali for some reason and generally you don't expect that now we see another gank on top we do have an ADC but Lucian didn't flash before so I think he didn't need to flash it's fine and we can actually do a bot gank here because they will they will engage now and I'm going towards this side we're gonna start here I'm gonna get the flash here that was, that was sad, that was really sad there, because Sivir got stunned in the moment that Nautilus stunned, uh, Sivir should have flashed faster, I did not expect Nautilus stun, but I guess, I guess we can still, that was amazing, that was an amazing flash, so we got there the kill, maybe even, Q? One you, one me, buddy. I believe it's fair. So we're winning bot, as predicted, because of the Nautilus. Because of how many amazing things he does. We can get the plate here. But the Kha'Zix is a problem. We need to stick. We need to recall properly. We need to all recall. Okay. And now we can go towards the top side. And he's dead. As predicted. And, okay, we're not going to play around top. We're going for the smite. And boots and also a tome okay and I say we're not going to play around top 
I believe he won't kill him here. I believe he won't kill him here. I believe he might even die. Nah, nah, nah. I... Yep. Yep. I was sure about it. I was completely sure that was about to happen because level 4 Lucian will never beat level 6. <laughs> the, the Wukong. And now we're going to be against a heavily fed Wukong and that's not going to be fun at all. I actually predicted the fact that uh, Lucian is going to get destroyed and it's not even the fact that he used flash because Kha'Zix yanked him twice and he didn't cast flash so there is no excuse on that, he could have just recalled when he got dived. Alright, so we're gonna get these two camps. Gonna farm as much as we can until the until the AP jungle item and we're gonna try to actually gonna try to actually help bot more because because I'm pretty sure killing Wukong is impossible without some CC. He can just W away if he's smart. If he's good he wouldn't even die. And we see level 6 on mid. And we're not really concerning ourselves with that. Because she will not die, I believe Akali is very safe. Obviously, Kha'Zix got the Drake. Uh, that's that's sort of expected. And I want to go there. Maybe I got. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Coming, 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 coming. Uh, maybe if Akali followed, but she didn't. So. We can get the scuttle though. We can get the scuttle because Kha'Zix is low HP. Okay, go on him. I want the scuttle. I really do. Never mind. Uh, kill her. Yikes, big yikes. Okay, so I'm just gonna go for blue then and try to work it out from here. Okay, or they will just int, which is fair as well. And we're going to get this blue. I'm, go I'm gonna do a full clear, and obviously, top lane is about to int very much. I would go there, but if I go there and we both die and eh, we lost the game. It's much more simple to stack around bot and try to help them and try to get the kills there or on mid because I have an assassin on mid than to do... How do I don't have wolves? I did take it before. So it's going to be pretty much impossible if we're not careful on top. After I get the AP jungle item it's a big maybe if we do that but before that absolutely not. And if Kha'Zix comes, which he could because he would just abuse the winning lane. If Kha'Zix comes, then we are done. Absolutely no chance of coming back from that fight. Did I just miss the W on a static target? Don't, don't talk about this, guys. I have the word there, so I'm pretty safe against against the Wukong. Alright, so I'm going golems. Gonna get golems. Gonna go back for the AP jungle item. And I need to stick around both, because as you can see, score is 5-5, Jin is fed. We want Jin to not give his entire bounty to someone, and we most likely won't get the bounty on the Wukong. So I'm just gonna do a full combo on those. Maybe they don't die on both. Maybe. Maybe. Back off, back off, back off. Back off. I'm not sure what Akali is doing, because it took her so long to reach them, but I think we win that. Okay, now I can just go mid, back off, you should back off, and probably Kha'Zix gets the Herald in the meanwhile, because he's away from for a long time, and then he will probably go top, that's what I would do if I were, uh, if I were the Kha'Zix. So, we could probably try to jump here and flash out if it's a problem. Yep. As predicted. I need to flash out here. Because I would have just died. And that's okay. It's okay. Could have just put a vision over. Why am I so dumb? Jesus. 
That was a horrendous play. Okay, okay, this is a free kill. Yep, dealing some damage there. Okay, I'm dead. Why did you stop getting herald? That's that makes no sense, man. Also, why is this guy dying so much? Jesus, stay under tower, he can't dive you. Mainly because of the 4 0 Kong. I need to abuse bot. I need to get stacks of Dark Harvest on bot to have any chance. Also, there is a Drake coming up. If, if Wukong comes now towards us, it's going to be a very difficult fight. Also, uh, just a fate having already the Rod of Ages makes things very difficult for us because we won't kill him. Let's smite this back Q. And. We can actually get this. Okay, get, 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 get her, get her. Ah, uh, auto attack, man. Auto attack. We could get this before it actually comes. I don't have smite. But my bet is that he won't reach us. This side. Okay, back, 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 mid, 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 fast, mid, fast. Okay. I'm gonna steal a bit of CS. Okay. I'm gonna back bot going because we have we have vision, we have a lot of vision. We could probably try to do an out here. I got her. Alright, two seconds before the actual thing happening, so yeah. Let's get this tower, so we have a tower as well. I can't help mid. She could actually probably kill that Kha'Zix. I think she did. Oh my god. That's good. That's very good. And I'm happy that Lucian didn't die again. So we, we got the advantage now. We got some form of advantage now. Also, lots of plates for the Jin. We have overfed the Jin, which is fine, but Wukong can actually destroy anyone. I could ult here. Don't think it's necessary. I'm just gonna get this wave. I'm not gonna hit. Oh, I'm gonna hit it. Wait. Haha! <laughs> Sometimes my genius is almost frightening. And at this point, I'm not allowed to go topside anymore because if Wukong waits in the jungle, I just need it. Even though I hit it once already. So this is a very difficult game because of that early int by the illusion. If he just stood there without doing anything, we would have probably had advantage at this point, a large advantage. But this way, not really. Also there's Senna is 04, but she is going to get tankier and tankier till the point I could not help her anymore. And we, that's going to be difficult. I could cast ult here, I could go there, I will go there, but I'm not going to appear only... Okay, that that's interesting. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna take it instantly. I'm gonna smite it so that there is no surprise of Kha'Zix, because it was from a weird angle. And now I can go towards the top side, because my bot lane destroyed Wukong, I don't know how he hinted. Probably full combo from Nautilus. 200 years, man. Nah, Nautilus is fine, it's a fine champion. I'm around. If you need help, I'm around with the ult. I'm just gonna cast here a spell. Okay. I'm gonna make level 9 out of this. And then these guys should be careful at the Wukong. And I'm coming there. I'm going where my bot lane goes because we need to continue the advantage that they just generated. And this is a horrendous positioning for you. Okay, they flashed out. Jin flashed out. Back up. Back up. Okay, we can we can actually do something here now. Not too bad. A 
we we should go for this tower because they aren't having four members here okay back one if Kazix jumps on you here you're dead and I don't think I can actually help you that much Okay, I need to be back for the Kha'Zix, but my bot link would actually solve the Kha'Zix problem by instantly one-shotting him before he would actually have time for anything. So let's just get this, and hopefully... Okay, coming back here. I think we can get the Senna. But Twisted Fate is in range, so we're not risking that. We're just waiting to see where... What are you doing here? Okay. Okay! Lucian got the kill. Okay, that's a bit too deep, man. That is fine. Okay. Starts to shape up, right? See if you play around the bot lane. Somehow things will fall into place. I expected uh, I expect Lucian to die against that, but apparently he somehow managed to win it, so props to him. Good job for coming back and not tinting anymore. Actually, the fact that he does not die, and did not die, is more important than the fact that he got an actual kill. Because we like him to be alive. And I am really in need of help, because I'm gonna die here if no one comes to help. Okay, apparently they did not do it. Let's just drag it out. Come on, team. Come on. Oh my god, I'm gonna miss it. Don't know. Frame drops, can't see anything. Oh, that's an alt though. It's my fault partially because I went into the pit to stop it and I got the aggro. And I'm having immense lags now. Frame drops. Yeah, that was sad. I guess Senna ult. I don't know, only from Senna ult it happens. Every time there is a Senna ult, my desktop, like, pff, huge explosions. Man. It's interested fate here. I can't really catch him. What I can do is move here and try something funny. Uh, we just need to push this wave. Okay, way back off. Yep, Nautilus is dead most likely. I don't know why he was there. What was the reason for him being there? I really don't know, man. Why did you go there? Why? That positioning just cost us a four-man fight. Why? What's the point of wording this zone right here? Flashing from this point maybe, but... He actually cast it on Senna, 0-5 Senna. Also, I needed to go back, but I, I'm tilting now with, because of that fight. I'm really tilting. Also having level advantage, which is great. But... Man, that cost us a lot. Alright, just wait for a fight, don't, just, just, just stop, just stop. If they wanted to kill him there, he could have, they could have. Even though he has flash, they could have. Also, this fate is over farmed, which means we need to catch him up, so we have to farm a bit. And they again, he again engaged on Senna, I think he, they got her this time, which is great. But last time, no one was near him, man. Okay, so we get this. As you can see, on this game particular, in particular, it wasn't that useful to go for Dark Harvest, because we didn't have any that many stacks, really. And we need to protect Jin from the Wukong. So we need to see where he comes from. Good 
play. <laughs> that was a pretty good play there, escaping. I'm not sure I escaped still, but that was pretty nice. Why did Lucian was there? God damn, that was a nice ultimate. I would have been caught. But almost, oh god, almost got that guy. Alright. We're gonna struggle against the Wukong soon enough after he finishes that dance. We are already struggling actually, we've seen the team fight without someone to stop him. It's actually pretty much impossible to deal with. The rights, okay. I actually got her here. I can't hit. Okay, we got her. She was quite fast, wasn't she? Okay. Let's push here. She didn't flash. I don't think she flashed. And there is a Wukong that comes from somewhere. Now Tilius should deal with that. Okay, we see him. That's the mistake of the Wukong though. Showing up is quite bad for business. Okay, I want that Drake, but... Uh, sorry, that blue. I think I'll just settle for this. But if you go Drake and they are all around Baron, then we might lose it. So I could probably recall. Okay, okay, get him, get him, get him. Yikes, if you got them here, if you got them there, it would have been better. But yeah, the chances are that we need to catch the guy. Okay, start it. No, no, your front line. Drag it out. Drag it out! Drag it out! These guys are incredible. These guys are incredible because I'm lagging when... Uh, hard to drag it out from the pit. You don't know where... They didn't know that he was on the top side. They didn't know that. I think I can catch them. Yeah, never mind. And again, the same lag happened from the Sen ult. I need 200 gold more for two stacks of two items from the Rapidons. So I'm just gonna steal CS, I don't care. I don't care. I don't think I still have. I need 30 more gold. Ah, actually, it's fine. I have enough. But we lost an inhibitor on that one and. I know now Tilus want to go top of that would have been just stupid. Would have just died alone. And going two people for Twisted Fate would have required just a Kali too. Just a Kali should have gone for the Twisted Fate. And that was a good macro counter from them. But still, I'm pissed at the fact that my Lucian didn't bother at all to pull them away from. Right, so can we have a word here? I'd say we could try to go for it, but no chance, and also, level 14 Twisted Fate by the way, did you clear it? I think he did by casting that. Come on, gather up, if you catch one, we go on the game, stop it, I'm just gonna cast this. I mean, she was coming. Okay, get him. Excellent. This this opens up the Baron. This opens up the Baron. With Wukong being on the other side of the map. Because Twisted Fate is one of the strongest in their team. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We afford to lose a tower to something there. Come on, hit it. Twisted Fate has no time to reach us. Pro 
problem problem is that Lucian actually went bot ah I went back and we will lose because now we're gonna get actually engaged on okay it's fine now it's actually fine Instant really calling to save this, but it's fine. It was a good call, it was an excellent call because they were bad. Man, Wukong should have came and we would have lost because Lucian counter recall was actually pretty bad. Because Wukong should have come and we would be four versus yeah, four versus four, and that would have lost us. So we won the macro there heavily because of their bad decision. I would say, I mean, you see this in any elo, I guess, but man. It was some poor macro decision from them. Also, I got the smite, like 50 50 smite, so I'm fine with it. Let's push mid now and let's get that. And okay, get him, get him if you get him. This one, this one, this one. Come on, come on, one. Ah, that's it. Uh, that's no longer it. Okay, we win, we win, we win, we win. Now we're just gonna lose because we didn't kill anyone. If you kill Du Kong there. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, nice. I believe they want to counter them. Uh. Kill him. Good. Come on, vision word. That's why I died. Should have done one second faster, but yeah. This is free. This is free. Get it. And we will win by this point. And I think I'm. It's most likely sure that because they got an inhibitor here, we actually got a lot of gold advantage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they will steal it. I was. Uh, I was hundred percent sure actually they will steal it. I don't know why it's an old silver Q, Twisted Fate cards. All deal more damage than an Akali Q. Uh, that actually cost up a lot. Not, not cool. Because they get one more drag, now we're in pain. We should have just. Uh. Alright, shall we take this and this? We're kind of going mid now. Too much. <laughs> Also, I start to stack this Dark Harvest, but I'm still so behind. Electric would have been way the better choice. Okay, I could ult. I could ult. Go, 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 go. They could clear it, but if I ult properly, they won't. Okay, we get the tower. Okay, we can get the inhibitor. Wukong is on the other side and we're fine. Okay, got that down. Kali lived, it's fine. Oh my god, why did you... I'm gonna lose the base now. Kali needs to recall, I need to defend. Okay, I could recall now. We, we lose the inhibitor, but there is nothing I could... What did stop me? What was that? A minion, a minion auto attack, I don't... Man, Lucian. Ugh. Big eggs. Very big eggs. At least it's 1-1 one, one this time, but big eggs. He legit died, I think, under tower. Should have just let me or someone else, but... Should have no one should have actually, we could have taken more. 
because Wukong couldn't finish there. I'm losing so much CS, man. But I'm a bit scared to farm around here. Also, there is that. I think I need to get one more wave, so I have the stopwatch. Please be careful, I'm not there. Still not having. Ah, okay, I have first of all. Back off. Back off. Back off. Not there. Okay, so let's get the stopwatch. Because against the Twisted Fate Gold card, if you press it before, then you're going to live. I think he did find her. Get that. Get that. No, don't go that way. Don't be insane. to recall uh, I don't like the 50-50 man okay go go we have time we have time if if he comes back here with ult okay okay it's fine we have time if Kazix doesn't steal it we have time okay uh, guys guys I guess I guess I could recall here I can't help you more, but I think he escapes. Never mind. Ooh, we did get the Baron though, and the Inhibit will soon be up. So that's actually better than losing. Good. <laughs> the, go the Baron call was good, though. Even without Tars, if you have the Inhibitor soon, then it means we're pretty much free to push mid. And. Even the Drake should be. Oh my god, what am I doing? Pretty much tired at this point of this game. Right, I could go here. I need 300 more gold. Perhaps if I speed up these clears. I don't have Smite. But maybe we have time to take it before. Okay, so Big eggs. Big eggs. Don't have smite. Don't have smite. Don't have smite. Let it reset. Okay. Fine. I think we can win now. We can we can actually push. Good thing he into. We're gonna have the we're gonna have the inhibitor soon. And at that point we're pretty much guaranteed to win if we're careful. Okay, I have a twist of fate ult, I could just, just recall. Get this and now and now we could we could go mid. We could definitely go mid, but they will keep splitting up. And we need Akali to kill someone because she's very fed. She can definitely get I think she can kill Wukong, to be honest. I'm not sure though, uh, she's probably the only one who has that potential because because uh, Jin is too far away from being anything. I mean, Jin is strong, but not that strong. Also, can lag spam. Let's get that. Back in Gohan Sinks, and now we do have inhib, so we got to be careful. We feel careful at this point. We're going to win. Can I stop having frame drops? Jesus, man. Fix your client, please. In your game. Yeah. Okay. I have Flash, I have Zonia. Probably have everything else if it's needed, but... Also having Vision on this side. So I think I'm pretty much safe to the Wukong. But he will keep pushing this. And this is not what we like. Okay, not good, not good. Good. Good, 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 good. Good. And get the Wukong. 
He doesn't have time to take the inhibitor. And Jin didn't even flash. Jin needs defensive items, man. GA or something. We can get him. But we can also die to him, both of us, if you're not careful. This is the best I can do. And he flashed. That's important because next fight, next fight, Jin will have uh, that. Will have flash. Nah, back off. Okay, Akali, get them down. Okay, we can actually do more here. Actually, do way more here. Okay, bad flash, useless flash. But we could probably end. Could probably end here. Nah, we don't. Okay, it's a 90. Okay. Okay. Wukong will jump in us. Just to run at this point, because Twisted Fate Ult is long. Going towards the blue. I'm still in danger. Still a bit in danger. Depends on the way that Wukong went. Okay, I'm seeing. I'm seeing them. It's fine. And we could rush Baron, which would be more important than the Drake. We could rush Baron and then end. Be honest. Let's finish that. Let's get that. Okay, rush it, rush it, rush it. Go, 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 go. Let's end this. Can I jump over it? Okay. I'm gonna help him if I can. If he comes towards me. Let's back to mid. Why is Jin there? Why was Jin there for the entirety of the fight? And now he just he just died. Hello, Jin. Jin. Wait, 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 wait. Ah. Uh, I think we won. Because we stopped both of them. Come on, end it. Redeem yourself and end this game. Come on. End it. Do, do it. Do it, man. Do it. Yes. Yes. Redeemer. The Redeemer Lucian, after all this time, also killing Wukong, so this is a nice arc of coming back into the game, but man, this game was too much for me, alright, so I really hope you enjoyed it, this 40 minute fiesta game that is, uh, and see you next time guys.